Well, well, well. If it isn't my fellow dome keepers. Uh, we're back. The game is on version 2.4, which comes with a lot of changes. There have been changes in previous updates as well. Uh, and for me, this is just going to be revisiting, well, pretty late to the party, okay? But 2.4 just came out. And it's added some new gadgets. We have a spire, an auto cannon, a prospection meter. Uh, the probe can now detect caves and chambers. All of the primary gadgets got rebalanced as well. Uh, Orchard got changed, Shield got more HP and Reflection, Electroblast got some big buffs. Uh, Repellent Wither now does, it doesn't reduce HP, it makes monsters take more damage while it lasts. There's Drillbert and Drillium changes. There's a lot of things, okay? And I don't even remember how to play. I, I mostly, I mostly do. But I'm just excited to get in here. Uh, let's go on Brutal for now. We'll eventually move back up to you asked for it. But I want to just play with these new gadgets a bit. Have a little bit of fun. We're not going to do any modifiers here. We're just going to go medium map size Brutal. Let's get in there. Oh, this feels good. This feels good. I'm not even skipping the cutscene. I want to see that slam. Or, you know. There's new enemies, too, that were in previous patches that I have not gotten to experience, so... Yeah, fun times. I've got my little uh, Mega Man-inspired outfit here, which I'll happily take. This is actually a, a very... Okay. It's not a bad start. That would be better if this were four. I don't think there's any, like, level three upgrades. There's some really nice quality of life upgrades across the top here. Um, so this one is an adaptive wave warner. And it's signaling when you should be going back to base, and it's predicting how much time you're going to need. Apparently, it gets better accuracy over time. I'm not sure the math that they're using there, but that sounds super cool. Uh, there's also this exit route that can be shown to you. Uh, it will show you the shortest path back to your dome, but it might not be the fastest, if that makes sense. It's just going to show you, like... This is how you get back, but if you take another route, you might be able to save time, I guess. And then, uh, this is really, really nice, especially for me. If you guys remember, there was a lot of times where the dome was getting really low, and you're trying to pause it, and then you're trying to go in, and you're doing a repair, and then you keep going, and you pause it, come back, do a repair. If you take this for one water, then it will automatically repair if it's about to be destroyed. That is huge mungus, okay? Huge mungus. Uh, everything else here, I guess we could look into maybe taking some dome strength and stuff, but anyways, we're, I'm, I'm well ahead of myself here. I just gotta focus on, let's just get a couple of things going, hopefully. I'll probably take some non-optimal uh, upgrades in the essence of experimenting a little bit. I'm gonna try and stay away from those heavy blocks for now. Come on, just any, any bricks. There we go. Oh, wow, they're being real stingy. That's better. That's better. They could tell I was getting saucy there. Okay. First of all, we got we to gotta do, do our keeper upgrades, like, immediately. Uh, let's go into speed for now. I feel like, I feel like maybe my timing's off. I'm obviously early. All right. Okay, I I was <laughs> very very early. Look at this little guy. He looks strong and friendly and cute and dead, especially especially dead. Okay, let's uh let's dig right down. Oh hello, little uh, cobaltium. Why would you dig it downwards? That's a great that's a great question. And that's a, it's a very valid question. Let's take these four up. We're going to pop a little uh, carry upgrade. And then... Uh, I, I'd probably be able to get the drill here. Because I think we have three in storage, right? So let's go here and take the carry slowdown. And we'll grab... What I presume is going to be the rest of these. Yep, this looks great. We still have a bunch of soft bricks there, but I am going to go ahead and take 
the drill strength. Let's just let this tabulate for us. Uh, so we want to go into a couple of things. So this whole tree across the top is new. Um, so I'm going to go here, even though it's not super necessary. But I want to get into this adaptive wave warner and give that a, a decent attempt. Let's cut through. Ooh, water bubbles. We'll take that. We'll take that. There's also some new, like, uh, caverns and all sorts of stuff that we're just going to be hopefully exploring. Oh, nice. My intuition is on point. Okay. I am, I am late, which, you know, if there's one thing I'm good at, it's being late. Do you mind? Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, that guy's got a big wind-up. Look at me re remembering to place the nipple back in the middle. That is... That is pretty special, let's be honest. Okay, so... A couple things. To get to this one, I do need to upgrade this middle path. Uh, but we're going to take the Adaptive Wave Warner. And I'm going to take the exit route. Probably not something I would recommend. Because these... Especially right now, we're early. But I just want to... I just want to try them. I want to get a sense for them before I start doing other things. Okay. Give me some resources. Or, you know, don't. It's cool. I feel like we've been uh, pretty fortunate in the soft brick department so far. Let's cut across here. Look at this. This is just like softy territory. Ooh, you don't say. Okay. Now, hopefully this is one of the new ones. If it's not, that's fine. We'll make the best. You know? We'll make the best. I think I could probably grab these. That seems fine. All right. What do we got? Resource converter prospecting meter. So this is new. A meter showing the distance to the nearest resources. Now, I can also see, I don't know if this was added this update or not, but it shows you what slot this is taking. And that apparently is called the cellar, the space below the dome. I would like the resource converter, don't get me wrong, but we're going to go uh, prospect, prospecting meter. Showing the distance to the nearest resources. Okay. So I see something in the bottom left there. Um, oh god. Okay, so there's my wave warner. And my and I got my little line there. And I'm back. I'm back a bit early, but okay, fine. Better safe than sorry, I guess. Sorry, I guess. Better safe than sorry. Uh da -da 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 -da. Yeah, okay. Let's just go to town here. Oh, oh, I actually was hitting him there. We need a laser upgrade soonish. Okay, so how do I... Okay, so that thing is like... It's glowing. Or it's getting... Oh! Oh! Okay, interesting. So it starts to fill as you get closer, but it also looks like um, the brightness is kind of changing as well. And I assume, maybe that was, maybe that's placebo, I don't know, but let's find out. Let's drop this off and go back. I assume this is only for non-drilled stuff. It's not going to direct me to the stuff I've already drilled. That seems to be accurate. Okay, so let me go up around here. Also, I should look at the upgrade tree. Okay, I'm getting closer. Nice. This is cool. This is cool. I, I imagine we can buff the range, and we can also probably unlock things to target uh, the other elements. So, let's take a look at that when we get back here. Probably upgrade my laser a bit if I can. Okay. Where are we here? So this is our dome. Here's the... Oh, cool. Water meter displays the distance to the nearest water deposits. Cobalt meter... Increases the detection range, which seems 
that seems like a really valuable upgrade. And then you go into here, displays the distance to the nearest gadget or relic switch chamber. Improved scan speed, how quickly the meter updates. Further increases the detection range of the processor meter. Okay, so these both seem very cool. Um, since it's early, I think what I'm going to do is take a little dome strength here. Okay, I should probably look at taking something like invulnerability. Uh, we love reflection. I love reflection. I remember that. I'll probably take a little. Uh, do I go? Let's go move speed here. I do like one of the things that they've added where it's showing you very clearly what's being improved, what's not. I feel like that's much better. Um, it still doesn't give you like, I feel like this should be represented in a percentage because I feel like going from 0.2 to 0.3, like I could do the math, but you know what I'm saying, right? Um, that's like a 50% improvement because you're increasing by 0.1, which is nice. But 0.2 to 0.3 doesn't feel... It, it, there's no, like, relative thing there. Anyways. Let's do combat. Okay. My little mosquito friends are back. Thankfully, they're all coming from this side. You know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna go for this. This is probably... This is probably not ideal. But this is what I... That's what I chose, okay? what I chose. Uh, also, when I upgraded the dome, it didn't get a chance to um, reach the max. So, let's take our one cobalt here and show our health. And then let's take uh, this. We'll reduce our melee damage by 15%. And now I'm, of course, uh, poor. Which is fine. Let's go back over here. We're probably going to need to upgrade our drill soon. I, I feel like um, perhaps the prospector meter could fall into trap category. Especially early. Because I, I think, like, like I'm on the right track here, but I feel like I'd be going this way anyways. Oh, hold on. Okay, so that was interesting. So it popped here, which means it's got to be below then? Yeah, okay. Never. Maybe not. Maybe it's not a trap. This is actually a way to just prove me wrong in the moment directly. I'm going to leave those. I'm going to carve out a new path up here. Oh, you don't say. Oh god, I'm too heavy. Okay. I don't like this. I don't like how late this is. This feels late, guys. This feels quite late. I don't... I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan of how late that feels, but... I may have gotten a bit lucky. I'm not gonna kill all the little ones there. I have some shield to play with. Oh, no, I don't, actually. <laughs> nope. That shield is gone. Okay, so I definitely need a... I need a power upgrade. I need a power upgrade here, but uh, I need a couple more of these bad boys. But that's fine. We're going to do a little cleanup run here because I had to drop a bunch of things along the way. And that's, that's part of the game. It took us a while to find this deposit, so... Yeah, I don't know. Maybe that that may have just single-handedly changed my opinion. Because uh, it was pretty clear I was going in the wrong direction. It was pretty clear pretty quickly, so. Let me drop that one there. We'll just take this in, and then we'll go back and get that last deposit. I'll probably drill around a little bit while I'm down there. Or maybe I can take an alternate path and then... Just see if we find anything else. Yeah, see, I'm lighting up here big time. Okay, so there's something in, the, in these, them, them, these hills. Uh... 
Oh god. Okay, well. I will take those. I need, I need damage, so we're gonna take the laser damage there, and then I'll, I'll pop a, I'll buy a reflection, I'll buy a reflection here. Oh my friend, oh my god. Uh, I don't, my reflection is not active yet, okay? Because I bought it after the wave started. That's kind of intimidating. Okay, so this is going to be primarily a cleanup run here. Let's take these bad boys. There's all these little critters around now, too, and I don't know if they're just for flavor. Or if they have uh, some type of tangible impact. And there should be two more cobalt up above us here. Uh, if I can choose to get the um, water prospector gadget part upgraded, I think that would be ideal um, over the cobalt. Especially since we aren't going to have the exchanger. Uh, but I think I need two water to get that. Even. I need, yeah, I need two water to get the water meter. Bit of a paradox, if you will. Let's take the drill speed here, and yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna go to the right. I feel like, oh, I've got action. You see that? There's action here. Damn, I love that. That's so nice. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna, okay, yeah, let's not risk it. Let's not risk it. I thought if I could just get the scanner to pop something there, then I could be like, oh, I know where I'm going. Yeah, I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Do I do anything here? Now, if I recall, the health one upgrade used to also heal you when you did the upgrade. So it's better to do this when you're low. I don't know if that's still the case or not. I also don't know if I'm just misremembering, which is 100% a possibility. Okay, throw me some sky demons here. Oh boy. I already committed to going to this side. Okay, I got a big fatty on the left. Okay, those those cannot be reflected. <laughs> Ouch. Now, um, I noticed something there. There was the, that shield meter went up and then went down when I used reflection. Trigger an active combat ability that reflects incoming projectiles. Now, does that use up my, uh, my like shield as well? I don't, I don't know. I don't know, but um, we'll try to pay attention to that as we go. Okay, we got drilling speed or drilling strength. So, there's got to be stuff on the right, okay? This is a big, empty cavern. Okay, we're getting close. Thank you, I need those waters. Oh, okay. Um, okay. That is definitely something new for me. And I'm going to come down and touch it <laughs> after this. Come on. Don't don't you dare. I think we're going to take some flight speed next. Now we are on a medium map too, right? So it's going to take a little while. What? Oh. Oh. That's like That's incredible. Is that permanent? That's actually, in my opinion, massive. 
So you just get a permanent zoom out. I like that a lot. I'm going to take this water meter. And then I'm going to take... Well, that's it down there, obviously. I could take this overcharge shield, but like... I have always felt this is only good if you have the exchanger. So you can constantly get water. Um, but now maybe with our water detection, that will be better. I don't know. Um, I'm going to take speed, prioritizing that over my um, weapon. Don't know if that will prove to be the right call or not. But, you know, here we are. Ever since I installed the reflector meter too, none of my, none of my flyers have shown up. But I got these rock throwers, which is just exceptional. Can I block this? Oh. I think I might be able to shoot them. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is like... Yeah, this is so... I've missed this game so, so so much okay oh this permanent zoom is sick oh I love it I never realized how big of a change that is like how zoomed in we actually are okay I'm trying to keep an eye on the meter we're actually getting some water detection here right right on the line I chose too it's funny it makes me feel like that upgrade is useless getting close. Okay, we were getting close. We got something over here. This is like an old-fashioned game of hot or cold. But it is it is quite nice, I will say. I'm going to carve a path out here. I think maybe trying to take the one that shows us other um, gadgets next might be sick. Gadgets and cavern detector. There's something about how fast it updates, too, as a potential upgrade. I don't know if that's, like, worth our time or not. Let's review. So, range in tiles seems great. And then that goes into how quickly it updates. So, this, I guess, is so... It, it, it has a delay of 1.5 seconds, which I guess would make a difference. This is probably a nice-to-have over a necessary thing. But the, the the range buffs seem pretty solid. So I'm going to take that. And then... Uh, I think we're still okay here-ish, right? Possibly, maybe? Can I do anything? I'm just going to see if I can get a, a ping on my meter. No, nothing. All right, let's throw down. I'll see, yeah, like I don't even think I should be going for that. Oh my God, that is significant. I'm about to take another one. Okay, yeah, I, I definitely misplayed that. This guy should be dead. Oh my god. Yeah, that, that's not worth me shooting at. At least with this power laser. Okay, that was significant. That was a significant um, problem. <laughs> that was bad. Okay, look. I'm already I'm detecting. We got water over here as well. Damn. See if I can find the water. Apparently there's more cobalt too. Oh my god. A, a haven. Now, uh, one thing I just realized is I should maybe... Whoops. I should maybe consider um, saving something like that. We get a nice cluster, saving something uh, for the tree seed. But, I mean, 
Who knows, right? Who knows? Okay, we need some carry capacity here. How far away am I from that? Not. I'm not far. Don't you dare beep at me, game. Don't. Don't even think about it. Get off my stuff. Okay, you may now beep. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, um... Yeah, I don't know how necessary that is as, a, as an upgrade, but... There is a certain quality of life thing that's nice about having your path... Uh, shown to you, you know? Okay. Let's try this now. Alright, so... No, I was wrong. I don't know if it was like that originally or not. Maybe that's been changed. Uh, but I think it used to be like that. Anyways, it's not anymore. I could do the automatic repair here. Or I can take the melee damage reduction to 40%. The biggest issue that we're having um, currently are those rock throwers. Which kind of sucks. Um, so I might, I might not go for that and just save for this range. And save for my extra power. I'll remind you, um, not a single flyer since I installed the... Oh, here we go. Does this guy get a speed ramp? I remember some of those enemies. Okay, okay. Well, well, well. So, if my if I have a detection of range of 8, basically that's huge, right? <laughs> like I can use that to ignore certain areas. I'm hoping. I'm hoping we can just get a good feel for that. This is a big fat delivery. I'm going to take a... I'm going to drop this, and then I'm going to head down just to see if I can get any pings. Just watching the scanners in the bottom left there. Anything on the old scanners? Yeah, well, I got water down here. Okay, so water... Nice. Oh, <laughs> you guys, I love this. I love this upgrade. At first I was like, yeah, maybe it's the trap. Nope, this is insanely good. This is insane. This changes... This change... I hate to be cliche, but this changes everything. I should take this power, okay? I'm gonna, t I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it there. Now I got. Um, I either go super rangefinder, or I go chamber meter. I'm gonna actually go range, range first, and then uh, I'm gonna pop one of these waters into automatic repair. So now, in theory. I never have to come in here to do a repair. I would like to take this damage reduction. But I'm, gonna, I'm gonna need some more cobalt um, just to have some repair um, options in case I, you know, make one of my a very rare uh, possible mistake or something. Oh, nice. Oh, these dudes are melting. Yeah, that power upgrade was beautiful. Okay. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Man, that zoom out. That is huge. I, if I could pick that every single time, I definitely 100% would. Also, there's more water here. I'm just going to drop all this. And there's more. Okay, my cobalt died there. Let's see if I'm getting hotter or colder on the water. I'm getting hotter. And I'm getting hotter on Cobalt, too. 
Colder on water. Colder on water, so it's got to be north. Oh. Hi there. Oh, very interesting. Okay, you're coming home with me. Immediately. I'm coming home. There's a there's a song that's like that. It's a long story. You probably don't want to hear it. Okay. I've got a condenser for water or a teleporter. I mean, how do I not take a teleporter, right? Is the teleporter still OP AF? It certainly feels like it is. It certainly feels like it is. Come on. Now, the, the teleportation aspect takes a little while. Let's see if I can carry all of this. There's still, um, oh, come on. There's still more uh, water being pinged down there, too. I better drop some of this. I gotta be back there. I don't know if that prediction takes into account how much stuff I'm carrying, either. Okay, would I like to go into speed? Yes, can I afford it? No. Great. Um, would I like to increase my dome strength? Yes. Reflect more often for a shorter amount of time. That's interesting. So currently it's five seconds once per battle. Maybe they haven't updated this, but it also says for a shorter amount of time, five seconds to six seconds, but that might be the total ability duration. So maybe it's three seconds each. I see. I feel like it was something like that in the past. Um, hmm. Interesting. I could maybe do this. Teleport duration, six seconds, down to two. Um, yes, we'll take that. Teleport anything you carry with you, except for resources and large objects. So, like what? <laughs> what, would, what would teleport with me? What's considered a large object? I imagine when you find the new um, upgrades and stuff, those are large objects. If it doesn't teleport resources... I guess it would carry uh, dino treats. It would carry... <sighs> I don't know. That's that's a weird one. Ultimately, if I can go teleport resources and reactivating personal teleports here, that would be great. But I need some more water for that. And I also need water for this other stuff. So, yeah. Let's, let's do this. Let's take the chamber meter. Okay. Um, I'm still sitting on this cobalt. And I do have two extra water, which is nice, so. Okay. We got fast boys. Oh, wow. That's aggressive. And they're strong, oh my god. Okay, so that's a problem. I'm going to actually dig here while I've got... Oh, I've got chambers as well. Okay, I have to go deeper here, I think. What's what's weird about this... Okay, here's my... Here's the cobalt drops. Or iron drops. I think I called it cobalt before, but you know what I mean. I need a drill upgrade, too. Um, this, this does change your style of play because you're so much more concerned with those meters. I'm hunting the water now. Really? That's further away? There it is. Oh, okay, we'll take this. I'm actually going to just take some of this back. There was a ping on um, 
on a cavern or something as well. So we got lots of action there. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Mm, we're going to take this. So we've got three for repairs. And we've got 40% melee damage reduction. I'm going to need to improve my drill strength soon. So I feel like... I feel like I should probably save some of these. I'm really tempted to improve my scan speed. Let's do that. And uh, let's go to town here. Okay. Oh boy. Like, what in the world? Oh, there. We saw the repair go off. That is so nice. I, w I wonder if people are, are gonna are saying things like um, that removes some of the skill ceiling and stuff. Like that is so nice to have. Let's take this back. We'll teleport down. We'll dig. Maybe find a cavern. Maybe find some cobalt. Who knows? See now, like I don't even need to dig in these things because my meter is not telling me anything. And later, when I get the Cobalt upgrade, then I can really hunt. It's so nice. I'm going to take the drill here. Okay, so Cavern is close here. We're on the right track, definitely. There it is. Oh, this is... <gasps> Oh, wow, that's better than Cavern, let me tell you. Okay, there should be water here. Damn. And then there should be Cobalt. Or, why do I keep calling this Cobalt now? Okay, I'm out. Now, it's a medium map, so this is, like, uh, this is exciting, but it's also not something to be too hyped about. I'm actually going to drop all of these. I feel like that was the right decision to make in that moment. I've got two repairs available. Um, let's just try and have a solid round here. Oh, the chickens. They go underground, right? Yes, they do. This dude. He's been on beam the whole time. Wow. Fake out. Love that. Don't know. Okay. Was that bad? It wasn't great, was it? it? Wasn't great. Okay, so I'm thinking if we can get one more water here, then uh, we could start going for a uh, little cobalt hunting. But also if I saved, if I saved some of my waters, then I could be going for the teleporting resources with the teleporter. But we're going to fully explore this meter. Having that faster update does actually make some difference. Okay, we have water and cobalt in the area. Oh my god. 
There's a sort of panic when you know that you're supposed to find it, but you're not finding it. It, it, it definitely changes your approach. It's really, really cool. Okay, let's take all of this up. This is a pretty nice haul. And then when we come down, we get the rest of the cobalt or the iron. Frick. <laughs> How many times? It's been at least a handful. At least five. Now, if this thing would have started beeping at that point, way down there when I had all these things, like, it would definitely not be accurate, so... Can I get into move speed here? Yes. Hmm, auto aim would be interesting, but... Thank God for that cobalt, because holy smokes. Look at how strong these dudes are. Wow. Okay, I've got four cobalt still, so I'm chilling. Um, I think the next ten, if I could go dome health. I do feel bad that I'm kind of neglecting our dome, but you just can't get everything you want, you know? Let's just pop this sucker down here. I feel like with this amount, even if I cut this in half and teleported, it'd probably still take me longer than just taking a slightly slower trip. Uh, you're seeing there, we were getting some pings on a uh, chamber or item or whatever. I wouldn't mind if they had a little sound effect for when something was pinging on your prospector meter. Just something like, something subtle, like a little uh, radar noise. You know, you could even have it different for each of those things, but I don't know, maybe that would be annoying for some. Not for me, because it was my idea, and my ideas are always good. Okay. Oh, damn. I got a lot of stuff over there I forgot about. Okay. Yeah, we got we got a lot of action in this area. Okay, I'm out. See ya. See how accurate this is, timing wise. I mean, yeah, it's something. I'm late. I'm late. I think realistically, if I can get into this this next tier here, which I should be able to if I have a, a clean dive next, then uh, we're laughing. This is going to be a problem, definitely. <laughs> Holy smokes. Okay, I'm down to two cobalt. <laughs> <sighs> Yeah, okay, I better take this. That sucks, but it's got to happen. Okay, let's go. I think that that chamber ping is very likely another one of these um, boxes. Okay, I'm actually getting further away. I'm going north there. Huh, nice. Okay, correct. 
All right, so the, the brain seems to be over to the right side there. So I'm still going to be spending time in this area. Now, if, if I was evaluating all of my decisions to this point, I'm probably thinking we don't go as heavy into the prospector part, obviously. We get into that teleporter a bit earlier, but again... I think for the purposes of, of trying this for the first time, pretty decent so far. Oh, is this the big boy? Yes. Yes, it is. I don't need that in my life right now, so it's fine. Oh, hello. You're the fast teleporter. I don't really... Need it. Um, you gotta like place it and then use it. <laughs> I guess that lets me more freely go into this where I can uh, teleport resources back. Right? But I also, my, my weapons need to be up here, so like I gotta. I gotta chill. I gotta, I gotta get those weapons going, because I, I think that's where I'm way behind. Oh, I can't believe I missed that. Get off my dome! Okay. Place the eye, teleport back to it. Right. Sure. So my goal here is to make sure that I have our end game option ready so that the run is quote unquote successful. Carrying too much. It literally dropped the wrong things that I was hoping it wouldn't draw. But it's fine. Now, uh, in trying to get enough for my weapon upgrades, I'm also foregoing my, my keeper upgrades, which I need also. That's what I love about this game, man. The push-pull of all the things you want versus what you actually need. Kind of crazy. Let's see if that's enough. I don't know if I'm carrying 10 there. It's close. And then I have to decide, do I go into massive power boost or do I go into the double laser? Yeah, that's a, that's a question. So there's more cobalt. Oh, wow. Okay. That I was not expecting. I thought that would be pinging me on that, on the last switch. Oh boy. I'm nervous. I'm very nervous. Now, here's the thing. I could go split, okay? I could go split. Increases my stun strength. Or I go power. And I absolutely wreck anything this beam hits. Hmm. I think I go split here. I actually am pretty happy with the amount of cobalt that I'm chilling with, so that's super cool. If I survive, I should, well, if I survive, I should survive this wave really no problem. Just 
give me all land things. Okay, that was not that great. Holy frick. So how many did that take me down to? Oh, not even that bad. Okay, we only used one there. Uh, but, yeah, like in that specific scenario, would have been really good to have the power, I think. Um, but I can double back and, and get that, hopefully. Okay, let's take this here. And we'll take this home real quick. If I can afford to get that thing teleporting stuff, that'd be excellent. But at this point, maybe not even that great. Auto cannon. Okay, auto cannon is new. So we'll take that over the condenser, even though I would love to have the water. Powerful automatic cannon on your dome that does heavy damage to monsters. Goes on the dome surface. Okay, let's look at these upgrades that we probably can't afford. Speed up. Grease the cannon gears for a significant speed increase. Improve all aspects of the cannon. I mean, yeah, that seems good. Machine gun increases rate of fire or heavy bullets for more damage. Autonomy. Auto cannon activates even when you're not inside the station. Okay. Uh, machine gun two, shock. So these are two separate branches. We go shotgun for more power or just increase your rate of fire. Um, bullet damage stays at six and it goes up to 20 here. But then you have some bullet spray as well. Anyways, that's. We'll see. Okay, let's find this cobalt. And it looks like I'm gonna find iron too. Hello. Oh, that was, yeah, why did I think that was iron? Great question. Um, Cause it wasn't. Let's see if anything else pings down here. The box is ready. Am I in a spot to fight the final wave here? Um, no, absolutely not. I'm not. Is that a challenge I want to try? Mm, maybe. Like, look at down in the depths here. I'm getting zero pings on my prospector meter. Sadly. Okay, I've got a cobalt ping. And water. Okay, I'm just going to take this and I'm out of here. That is called discipline. I'll leave this down here. Because my other teleporter's off to the right. I think I'm still going to be late here. Oh, that was actually, that's pretty, that's pretty accurate. That was pretty good. Okay. Okay. Let's... I feel like these might not kick in, but let's take the improved auto cannon and see what happens. Oh, not this time. Not this time, bud. He's even pre-firing. Did you see that? He pre-fired on that bird as he was about to come out of uh, his invincibility. Oh, what a good... Okay, okay. Auto cannon. This has been great because we've been able to... Um, we've been able to experiment with a lot of new stuff. I'm just going to drop this here, and then I'm going to teleport back over here. And I'm actually... Okay, we're getting further away, which means that stuff must be up here. No. 
Huh. Okay, maybe left? Yep. We're getting further away, but there's more water down here. that cobalt. There we go. Oh, hello. Um. Okay, this is awkward. Because I have to go. So you can plant there. This was, uh, that was, I was, I, I was kind of panicked. This is not ideal, clearly, but whatever. Also, I didn't set a, a teleport over there, so I'm going to have a little bit of extra wasted time. Okay, auto cannon, go. Oh, I got mixed up. I got my aiming all weird. Okay. Let's do one of these, okay? I'm gonna take this bomb up there and just get it ready. We're just getting it ready, okay? We're just getting it ready. Video's already getting kind of long. Let's just get you close to the surface. Okay, now you, you come with me. There was some decent teleport usage there uh, at one point until I kind of stopped using it. Grab all of this. I might be able to afford the 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 teleport resources upgrade now. There's cobalt up here. Or uh iron over to the left. The other interesting thing about this is, um, typically, you want to go about three blocks apart, right? Because if you find an iron deposit, you'll always find it. It'll always be in batches of two, so if you have blocks that are three apart, you farm out that, and you're always going to find iron. But what that means is you could miss water, you could miss uh, cobalt, and by having that upgrade, even late game, you could find cobalt much closer to you than um, than you would kind of expect. Uh, what do I do here? I think this is pretty cool. I just don't know if I should go like heavy bullets or if we should do this. This upgrade path is clearly more expensive. That tells me it's better. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do. We're going to take one of those, but that's it. I can't, I can't be too spendy here. We have how much cobalt right now? Nine? That feels good. That feels good. Ooh, sick. It appears that when I use that ability, it, it does take my dome uh, health away, which feels kind of weird. I don't know if I like that. 
Let's take this up. I think if we get the, uh, if I can get into like a double, or uh, the, the, the laser strength upgrade, we'll just kind of try our best. I don't think we're going to be able to handle it, but we have a lot of cobalt, so that's cool. We'll see. roots I know but uh, oh that's also gonna throw off my meter that's interesting because the meter was still detecting it there let's take this back it's a pretty solid haul Then maybe we do one more run. I don't think this gets me to the 24. Oh yeah, it does. Okay, okay. Water and uh, cobalt down there. Okay, let's do one more of these. See how it goes. And now we're freaking blasting. Oh, look at that guy. That's new. He's dead. Holy smokes, we crushed. Okay, I think this is going to be our last dive. So, let's see what we can find. I'm going to prioritize Cobalt. Okay. And is there any water over here? It appears to be. See if we can get into some softer brick here. Man, that works very well. I am so impressed. Now, ideally, I'd want to plant that, that tree root on <laughs> not iron. Uh, but something like cobalt or water, but we're so late it didn't really matter, so that's why I didn't put a lot of stock into that choice, but. There was another um, cobalt ping down there I might go try to hunt. Thick brick. Nice. Oh, just one. I think I can still make it back, and... Let's see. A little later than I'd like, but... Now our next one will be definitely our last one. Those. That's 
interesting. That's a cool attack, actually. Okay, this is our last one. interesting over there water I just basically want to make sure that I'm back in the dome at like at the optimal time so that I'm not uh, delayed on that last wave And we'll make an we'll make a good attempt. Let's see if there's any last upgrades I could get here Look I think I could I think I could take uh, the shotgun Upgrade there and then I only need um, Seven more is slow. I think I could have taken the stuff to the north way faster. And this is dropping baby stuff. Okay. And I'm going to drop one. Pick another up here. And this is it. I gotta take that bomb in too, actually. Frick. I'm gonna be late! Okay. Now, I don't even know if this one will count because I'm in here late, but... Let's take it. Are there any other, like, nice-to-haves here? I got two and three. Mm. Not really. So let's just buy these. And we got 12 on the repairs. Okay. You look friendly. What is that? He's like invulnerable. Or he was. Holy frick! Come on, die on the right. Anytime. Pretty close. I mean, for a first attempt back, trying a bunch of new gadgets. Not too shabby, man. Not too shabby at all. God, I miss this game. So fun. So, 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 so fun. Man, that was excellent. The, the downside is we've unlocked, like, all the things, so you're not unlocking stuff, but, um, yeah, obviously trying to beat the final wave is, is really fun, too, and I think part of the ultimate goal, but, yeah, really liked this a lot. Let me know uh, what you guys want to see next. Obviously, I've, I haven't spent a lot of time with the new Assessor. We tried him one time when he first released, or he or she or there, whatever. Um, and the playstyle is quite a bit different. But I'm thinking until we get a grasp of, like, most of these things, that, um, Engineer, like, for me is still the most fun to play because it's less 
finicky than the assessor, but I just haven't practiced it much. So we also have uh, the new changes to the uh, to the sword. So apparently this plays way differently now. And then we have all the other gadgets to try out. So let me know what you guys want to see and we'll go from there. Thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.